Hey everybody, it's Neil and uh, welcome to the shed. And here I have, this is the uh, PIM recycling dropper box bottles. I don't know, we'll show you guys what they are here in a second. I'll open it up. I already kind of opened the top. Let's aim you guys down a little bit so you can see what we're doing here. So it comes with a bunch of little washers and toppers. And then we have the little filling uh, thing. And then we have uh, a lot of stuff here. So, so let's open up some of this stuff and I'll show you guys what we're talking about here. I don't know, let's just start with this one here. So look at this little bottle. Very nice little black glass bottle. And let's see what's in this. Comes very well packaged in the most amount of bubble wrap for the tiniest little device. Ah, the little glass tubes. Look at that. So it's like a little diffuser thing. So let's see. So we have these glass tubes. We have that. Uh, here's more bottles. So it looks like we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We've got eight bottles. And then these are going to be the tops and stuff. So let's see how these are. So it's got the little a little dropper. I guess that would give a, a little stopper if you wanted to not have any smells coming through. We have a screw top and let's see, there we go. Oh, I'm not, this is the filler. This is the filler. So it goes like this actually. So, so there, so now we have a little dropper. I guess it goes this way. Yeah. So there, now we have a little dropper and it goes into the bottle. And so there you go. So now it can be sealed up with a little dropper in it. And then if you wanted to get some little essential oils or whatever it was in there, the smelly stuff out of it, you can squeeze it, get a little dropper full and squirt it wherever you want, put it on yourself and then close it up. Look how nice that is. And it seals up really nice because it's got the little rubber. Here, let me show you here, um, the little rubber piece when it's in there, when it's going in, it covers the top. So it's sealed up really nice. Not like you don't even need the washer in there. It comes with a little washer as well. Here, so that's gonna go in there as well. So, but really nice. And you can put your little essential oils or whatever you want in there. Actually, I guess the way you do it is probably put it like this. Let me show you. How do I open this? These are like a little nylon uh, washers, I guess. Where's that knife? There we go. Ah, uh, yeah, these are soft. Okay, so I guess you can do like that. Maybe they have the little washer on it. Or you might even be able to, I don't think you can push it through this way. Mm, I don't think the dropper will make it through. I'm trying to do it that way. Nah, so the way I had it the first way was right. <laughs> now I got it stuck in there. Let's see. Oh, no, I don't. I push it through. So, yep. So the way it will work, you push the little washer through there. I guess it kind of keeps it from sticking. So there you go. And then you've got the little white piece in there, and you can close it up. I guess it just makes it seal a little easier. So you can open it. I guess it won't get stuck. I guess the rubber might get stuck otherwise. But very cool. Nice little bottles. So you can put labels on them, you know, magic potions, whatever. I'm going to try doing my laser uh, engraving on here and etching something on these. So it'll be kind of cool. But I like these. These are nice little dropper bottles. So very good. Thumbs up for me.